We've always been concerned about uh, animal welfare and we uh, felt as a, as a family farm uh, this addressed that next concern about animal welfare because our conventional housing system met all the concerns regarding animal welfare but it didn't give the ability to the hen to uh, exhibit some of its natural behaviors which is perching, uh, scratching and then going to a quiet nesting area to lay its egg. There's no difference in our hens. Our hens were happy in our conventional housing system and our hens are happy here. I put it similar to like riding on an airplane. You're, you're on the same plane. In economy, you have a little less space. In first class, you have a little bit more space and, and you're catered to a little bit more. In some of those systems, you have to recognize that those hens uh, are more likely to be injured because they have the ability to move around more. And so there could be some, uh, some injuries to the hens, uh, maybe a little bit higher mortality because of uh, the hens in a pecking order because they are, uh, they do establish a pecking order so the weaker hens have to try and shelter themselves more from a more dominant hen. But what I worry about is uh, these companies that are making these decisions and don't understand how we produce eggs in Canada. That's my biggest worry. Uh, you have the corporate companies of the world making these decisions and they have no idea how we produce eggs. And so for them to make these decisions uninformed is the part that worries me because they are um, making decisions based on, I would call it peer pressure from the animal rights groups. Rather than coming and talking to us, 